What's going on with the sign of Aries for October? October. Okay. Some of you are exhausted. Some of you need to take a break here. Because you have some kind of unfinished business. And this is causing conflict. So I see you taking a break here because there's a lot of conflict. And you have some kind of unfinished business. There may be some kind of job that you need to complete. Or some kind of cycle here that you need to close out because it's causing conflict. So I see you holding back. Because there's conflict here. But you're hiding it. You're guarding your heart. You're saving your money because there's too much conflict here. But you're hiding it. You're hiding your true feelings. And there's going to be some truthful communication about this. That you're hiding your true feelings. And you're trying to save up some money here. And you're holding back. And somebody's going to come in here and set things straight. You could be dealing with a Libra, a Cancer, a Leo, a Scorpio, a Taurus, or an Aquarius. But I do see you holding back here because there's causing conflict. And there's going to be some truthful communication about this. Somebody wants to come in here and set things straight. And you're walking away. <clears throat> you're walking away from this because it's causing you to have unfinished business. It's causing conflict. It's exhausting to you. There's going to be an invitation to a social event here. You could be traveling towards someone here because you're walking away from this. Because the situation has ended and somebody feels hurt, they feel betrayed, they feel stabbed in the back. So I see you're holding back, you're hiding, you're hiding your true feelings here and there's going to be truthful communication about this. You're going to come in here and you're going to set things straight because you're walking away. And there is going to be an invitation to a social event here but you feel hurt, you feel betrayed, you feel stabbed in the back and the situation has ended. And you're focusing on your wish fulfillment. A wish is about to come true for you. You make good, good news at work. This is going to make you very happy. This could be concerning property. Somebody's going to come in here and set things straight. A decision is going to be made and justice will be served. <clears throat> But a situation has ended here. So you're focusing on your wish fulfillment concerning some kind of property. And all of your emotional and material needs are going to be met. You could be dealing with a mother, a Libra, a Taurus. But I see you traveling to somebody's home here. Because somebody's not willing to put in the work here. So I see you coming in to set things straight. Yeah, and somebody's not willing to put in the work here. So you're going to have some kind of unexpected bill. This is going to be a life-changing experience. It's going to be something very unexpected. Because somebody's lying, cheating, or stealing here. This person has ulterior motives. And you're going to have an unexpected bill because of this. And this could be putting you into debt. Because somebody's lying, cheating, or stealing. So you're going to have some kind of unexpected bill. The situation is too one-sided. And this could be putting you into debt. So you're focusing on your wish fulfillment here. And this is pissing you off. So I see somebody coming to rush in here because the situation ended and it's putting you into debt. Somebody's lying, cheating, or stealing. So I see somebody coming to rush in here. And somebody's going to come forward and express some kind of offer here. This could be an apology. So this person's going to apologize to you here. 
And I see you getting sudden wealth. Because there's an offer, a financial opportunity that was made here. And I see you stepping out of your comfort zone and getting sudden wealth. You could be dealing with an Aries, a Scorpio, a Gemini, Libra, an Aquarius, a Pisces, and a Leo, and a Virgo. But there's going to be a friend that enters your life that helps you step out of your comfort zone here. And I see you taking back control of your life. But I do see you stepping out of your comfort zone. So I see you taking back control of your life and moving things forward here. And there may be an unexpected bill due to a vehicle. But I do see somebody traveling towards you. Or you could be traveling towards someone else. But I do see you trying to take back control of your life here and move things forward. And there's going to be some kind of back and forth communication. But there's a delay. Could be a delay in communication due to a vehicle. Because somebody's pissed off about this. Because this situation is putting you into debt and it's too one-sided. This person's not being honest. And you're going to have an unexpected bill because of this. So I see you making plans here. Some of you could be dealing with a Pisces or a Cancer. A Leo or a Virgo, but I see you stepping out of your comfort zone and discussing some kind of plans to get yourself unstuck from this. Because there's a lack of counsel here. Somebody's abusing their power. You could be dealing with a Libra, a Sagittarius, but there's a lack of counsel here. So I see you living in life's little luxuries. And you feel like you're wasting your time because this person's abusing their power and there's a lack of counsel here. So you're wasting your time. So you're focusing on your independence and trying to step out of your comfort zone. I see you traveling, moving things forward here, but there's a delay in communication. So I see delay in communication, a delay in travel. So I see you making plans here because you're pissed off. Because this person's abusing their power and you're wasting your time. So I see you trying to successfully complete a project in your home environment here because you're wasting your time with this situation here. And you could be getting on the phone and making plans with somebody that's at a distance from you to partner up and contract with somebody here. And you need to make a choice. Because it could be causing an upset in your home environment here. It could be stopping you from completing some kind of job or project in your home environment. You could be dealing with a Gemini here, but you're trying to make clear and objective decisions. And you're paying attention to the red flags here because there's a delay in communication. And you're trying to take back control of your life so you can move things forward. Yeah, you're going to have to make a choice between two things here, Aries. You definitely could be dealing with the Gemini. <clears throat> but you have to listen to what these people have to say. Pay attention to the red flags and make clear and objective decisions concerning this contract, this partnership, or this relationship. And somebody is going to need to make a choice. You're going to have to cut out the things that don't serve you here because somebody's manipulating you and abusing their power and you're wasting your time. So I see you coming out of this depression here and you don't want to miss out on this opportunity. Because an offer that was made fell through. So you're spending some time at home doing some kind of coaching or spiritual teaching or mentoring because it's causing conflict here and you're doubting yourself. So you're waiting for your ships to come in 
and you're keeping it to yourself because there's too much conflict and you're doubting yourself so you're trying to get some kind of coaching or mentoring on this and you're keeping it all to yourself some of you could be a high priestess some of you could be dealing with one some of you could be getting coaching or mentoring by a Virgo or a Pisces but you're keeping all of this to yourself because it's causing an upset in your home environment here so I see you trying to successfully complete a project in your home environment here because it's causing an upset but you're keeping it all to yourself because somebody's acting recklessly they're either rec acting recklessly with their spending habits or an addiction or this person's playing you so you're making a decision so you can stop stressing out about this. And there's an opportunity here that was made that falls through. So you're trying to prioritize because this is making you feel stuck. Because this offer that was made falls through. So you need to reevaluate your priorities because this is making you feel stuck. You could be having problems with electronics or appliances here. But I see you taking action. You could be dealing with another Aries because this is making you feel stuck and this offer that was made falls through. And you feel overwhelmed. You feel attacked. So you're making a decision. So you can stop stressing out about this and you're trying to heal from this some of you could be stars some of you could be dealing with an Aquarius but you're on the right path and there will be a happy outcome this is going to happen on a sunny day there's going to be a happy outcome but this was making you feel stuck and you're overwhelmed so you're making a decision that you want to heal from this. And there will be a happy outcome here. Because Aries, somebody's only doing charity work here for their own selfish needs. This person will cause you to lose money because this person is emotionally unavailable. You may be dealing with an Aquarius, a Leo, or a Cancer. Or a Scorpio here. But somebody's only doing charity work here for their own selfish needs. So I see you taking action because this relationship is not growing closer between you and someone else. Because this person's playing mind games and wants to win here at all costs. And this is overwhelming to you. You feel attacked and you're trying to heal from this. Because somebody's not willing to buckle down and get things done, somebody's not willing to honor their commitments here, and somebody's being lazy. So I see you focusing on your financial stability here at work. You have the Midas touch right now. Anything you touch turns to gold. You're being very committed and loyal to your work and your relationships here, but you're not investing into this anymore because this is a bad investment. Yeah, there's going to be a delay in taking a trip here because this was a bad investment. And you're not going to invest into this anymore. Because things are not moving forward. And somebody doesn't have the confidence that they need to have to take action. Could be dealing with the Leo here. There could be some kind of issues with jealousy here. There could be a reason why somebody's relationship is not growing closer because somebody's emotionally unavailable. Things are not moving forward. And somebody's jealous here. Somebody's too insecure here. So you're giving up because this relationship is not growing closer. And things are not moving forward. But you're not investing into this and there's a delay in taking a trip because of this. And you're not waiting around anymore because things are not moving forward and you have the Midas touch right now.
So I see you coming back around for being left out in the cold. But this is causing you to have a lot of anxiety, confusion, and you have to pick. You have to pick something here. You have to pick and make a choice. Because you have a lot of options. You have to pick one. But somebody from your past is going to be returning to your life here. And there's a new person that's going to be stirring up your romantic feelings. But you have a lot of options and this is causing you to have anxiety. Some of you are going to have the resurgence of a relationship. Some of you have new a new person who stirred up your romantic feelings. And some of you are having anxiety because you're not sure what to choose about a new home. Some of you are going to get news of the birth of a baby here. But you're having anxiety over this new person that stirred up your romantic feelings or this new home or this new relationship here because you're unhappy in your family life. Because there's arguments here concerning this new person that stirred up your romantic feelings. And you're trying to heal from this. And you're having bad memories from the, the past about how you're trying to heal from this. About how you're unhappy in this family or this relationship. About how this new person came into your life and stirred up your romantic feelings. And all the anxiety and confusion and how you had to come back around from this. And I see somebody reaching out to you here for an opportunity in business. This could be online, over the phone, or on camera. This could be concerning a new home. This could be some a new person that stirs up your romantic feelings online, at work, on camera, on the phone. You could be um, receiving some kind of opportunity for a new home. But somebody's not willing to put in the work here. I see you trying to collaborate with somebody here, but somebody's not willing to put in the work. Can we deal with a Capricorn? And you're trying to release this burden and heal from this because this person's not willing to put in the work. And you're having bad memories from the past. So you're not sticking around. You're getting a new perspective on this. Because this is just a false start. There's a lack of passion. So I see you dropping some kind of baggage here because this was a false start and you're not sticking around. And you're going to take a new risk, a new leap of faith here. Because somebody's not willing to put in the work. Somebody's not willing to build a solid foundation or be a team player and you're releasing this. It was a false start. So I see you taking a new leap of faith here and releasing any kind of attachments that you have. And I see you letting your walls down here. Concerning some kind of father, a boss type individual, or an Aries. And you're deciding that it's not too much work. Because this is causing arguments. Can we deal with a Capricorn, an Aries, a Pisces? But this is just a false start here. You could be dealing with another Aries. Scorpio. Capricorn. But there's some kind of arguments here. There could be some kind of overindulgence in food, drink, or alcohol. While you're celebrating with some kind of friends here. This is just a false start. So you're trying to handle things in a kind and understanding manner because you're not ready. 
You could be dealing with a Virgo, a Gemini, and a Virgo. But you're not ready. You don't have all the resources and the materials that you need to have to manifest whatever it is that you want. This is just poor timing. And luck is not on your side. Somebody could be manipulating you, Aries. Yeah, this is poor timing because you don't have enough information. Somebody spreading white lies and gossips too much. You could be having an ex-lover that returns here and this person's not telling you the truth. This could also be somebody that's part of your spiritual tribe, like-minded friends, or part of your community, but you don't have the same values or morals as this person. But this situation is not over. And somebody's not willing to make the changes that they need to make. So I see you having to balance out your emotions. You have one foot in and one foot out of this situation. And you're testing out the waters. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus. Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, and a Sagittarius. Aries. Okay, Aries, October, October for Aries, Shut. okay, something's going on in the family room, and somebody's being false here, so somebody's not being honest concerning some kind of family room situation, on your pathway and this is causing somebody to have bad health this could be involving a privileged lady somebody could not be being honest here and this is causing somebody to have bad health you could be dealing with a privileged lady you could be getting a message of concern from a privileged lady And somebody's having bad health because somebody's not being honest. This is concerning the family room of a house. Yeah, somebody's going to have to make a choice here. This could be concerning a contract or a relationship. But somebody's going to have to make a choice here because there's going to be a message of concern. This could be from a privileged lady. This person could be having bad health because somebody was being false concerning a family room situation. And this is involving a mature woman. In a house so expect a message of concern and somebody's gonna have to make a choice between two things concerning this mature woman in this house this could be concerning a contract or a relationship okay Aries step out of your comfort zone because the energy is gaining momentum. The answers you need are coming. But it's a time for you to give rather than take. And the confidence is your key to success. Let's see. Aries. Anything they need to know. Okay, Aries, I don't know what's going on, but the answer is no. There will be a peaceful resolution. And there is an opportunity here, and you're ready for it. Good luck. 